Here, the Supreme Court had an excellent opportunity to fix the mistake of the intelligible principle test, yet it didn't even take a swing at the case. As I said, we may never know why. I suppose the most generous view would be that there are more important cases to deal with this term, but I don't see that. Which leaves me with what I believe is the more likely reasons. Either it was politics or the desire to maintain the unconstitutional administrative state, neither of which are good for the Republic. As Justice Thomas said, because the standard this court currently applies to determine whether Congress has impermissibly delegated legislative power largely abdicates our duty to enforce that prohibition, I would grant the petition, which is why it is so important that we, the people, read and study the Constitution, not only so we are prepared to defend and assert our rights from the abusive powers of the bureaucrats, but so we can hire representatives at the state, federal, and yes, even local level to help us protect ourselves and our rights. Because as long as unelected bureaucrats have the power to make the rules, we are not a republic, and we are most definitely not free.